I've played Guild Wars 2 for over 20,000 hours, and I've learned a whole lot and collected just about everything in the game, so it's a perfect time to go round again. Join me in the adventures of my completely fresh account known only as the Microtransaction Enjoyer on the quest of obtaining and unlocking everything in the game, from legendary gear and mounts to living world story episodes, maps, and ultimate gem store quality of life, purely through efficient and somewhat sensible gameplay. No real money required. My goal with this is to show you what you can do and to do, in my opinion, what I consider to be the right decisions, the decisions that are um, going to progress you. So, in other words, uh, I'm going to show you guys what I would do if I was joining the game today, right? I'm going to make my own groups. I'm going to join a guild. Yeah, I'm going to learn the game. I'm going to get into raids. I'm going to get into... I'm going to get into... I'm going to get into PP. Get into World Buster World. Get into Open World. I'm going to join the meta train with Hardstuck. In my opinion, I want to talk about the inner stuff. I don't want to talk about, oh, how, what order are we going to do the story? That's honestly not very interesting. There's not a lot of decision making going on there. I want to talk about the kind of player who's got the basic, right? We've done our story. We've done our map exploration a little bit. What are we doing next? Where are we going? So the reason why I can teleport to a friend is because at the end of the day, I'm expecting people to, you know, they've already got the story locked, right? Like this is, it's not really necessary for me to play through all of it on stream. That's like 30 hours of me doing nothing, right? Do you guys really want that? No, no, you don't. Uh, let's go ahead and grab ourselves some hero points. Where are my hero points? I'm just going to go out uh, like explore the map a little bit. Oh, wait, is the, um, let's see, is the Leviathan up, actually? Oh, it is actually up. Hang on a minute. Let's get over there. Let's get over there. Go, 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 go. I think what I'll probably do, guys, I'm going to finish up unlocking Firebrand today, and then that will probably be the end of the session, like just getting Firebrand done and fully unlocked step one, right, is getting firebrand. So we're going to go grab that. I might look in the LFG for a hero point train. But that's actually really worth pointing out because this is actually something that's very, very common, right? Um, let's see if we have any, actually. Oh, God. Uh-oh. Wait, am I going the wrong way here? This is not, this is not right. I'm lost. I think, I, no, I, I can go this way. I need to go the wrong way. I need to go the right way, chat. Wait, is this the right way? Dude, I'm actually trolling, man. I'm lost. Without the skyscraper, guys, like, you know, I, I'm, I'm useless. I can't do anything. I might be forced to have to use my uh, teleport to a friend. Yeah. You have the southern waypoint on it. Oh, shit. So I do. You're absolutely right. Yeah, because I died. Nice. Beautiful. We're in. We teleport hacked. My favorite. My favorite. Ooh, hero point. I think I better go get tag the Leviathan first, so we'll grab that hero point in a bit. No skiff. Oh, man. It's got our underwater ability set up here, actually. Uh, we'll do just basically the same thing. We'll just do a lot of shouts, I think, is what we're going to want. Big shouts. Huge. Let's go. Oh, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute, lads. I, I need to get- I need to get a fucking move on. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Go, 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 go. Come on. We gotta get in there. I really want to tag this. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No! Oh my god, that is actually a huge throw. Dude, why did I- I was not paying attention. I was not using swiftness. That is tragic. That is two gold down the drain, right? That is two gold down the drain right there. Unlucky. Already failed. Already failed day one. Tragic. Unlucky. Well, that's why you should always be paying attention, chat. Okay, you always got to pay attention, miss the event, end up like me. Unlucky. Yeah, you snooze, you lose, guys. Is what it is. You snooze, you lose. I have losed. I'm going to quickly go over here and just like explore the map a little bit so I can see where all the hero points are. I'm going to grab those. Next order of business is going to be hero points. We have a good chunk of this map explored. Is there a hero point over here? There actually is. Let's go grab it while we're here then. Hero point time. Let's see, can we actually get there? Yeah, we can. Nice. We have made it. Huh. Wait, yes, no. No, no, no. Maybe. Oh, is this not the way? I'm not sure it wants us to do this. It does not want us to do that. I think we can go this way, though. Let me up. Hell yeah. Oh, shit. Right. Let's go. Elite. Oh, shit! It dodged my sanctuary. Dude, this thing is insane. This thing is cracked. I think we can actually immobilize it and then uh, break its bar there. There we are. What a beast! This thing is insane. Should be able to get our DPS going here. Yeah, no problemo. Whoa. 
Hey, look. Look, it can't touch us. We're just too tanky. Got too much healing going on. Insane. Okay, great. There we are. Let's get our CC. And there it is. Dead. Easy Venom Caller. Let's yoink this hero point. Boom! Hell yeah. Oh no. I've actually... Th that's slightly unfortunate, isn't it? I don't have a skiff. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I think we can actually climb onto a building and glide down over here. See, this is the kind of problem solving that I actually kind of like. Right? Because now... But do, do you see how this has turned into gameplay now? Instead of having no problem or any obstacle whatsoever, now I actually have to problem solve. So now I'm going to go, okay, what am I going to do about this? Uh, well, I've decided that I'm going to go to high ground and try and glide over there instead, right? So now this has actually turned to a little mini game. It's actually become like a little exciting thing that we can do. I need to get up pretty high though, actually. This is not going to be good enough. This is not going to be enough. This might do it, actually, I think. Ooh, yeah, we can go over onto this as well. Great. Yeah, that should do it. See that? I, I think it's the small pleasures in gaming, right? I Isn't that cool? I like that. Am I crazy? I feel like I'm not crazy. Isn't that cool? So we need to get to where we want to be. We're going to need another 18 hero points, right? So we're going to need another 155, another 16. So we might as well just do all of them, actually. Boom. Got him. There it is. Easy. Another hero point. We're on fire right now. We're absolutely zooming. Okay, so we'll grab this waypoint, then we'll get uh, this hero point here as well. Probably not going to get all the hero points on every map, actually, because, you know, some of them are going to be a little bit of a pain. Some of them are going to be more annoying than others. Boop. Got that one. Easy. Ah. Okay, so what I think what we can do here is we can climb on this rock and then leap our way across. Will it even let me go on this rock? What? Nice. Got it. Okay, great. Out we go. See? Listen. For me, guys, that is gameplay, right? See, that is cool. I want more of that in my video games, okay? I want more of that, not less. I think I have to, like, leap around and use my character's abilities to actually do something, right? That's fun. Okay. Uh, so I think we just want to go to the north here, right? Yeah, we just go to the north, and then there's probably, like, one more over there that we can get easily without being too annoying. I think I might just swim to Kaineng real quick just to unlock that map. Oh, I can do a few more in Dragon's End as well, right? Um, yeah, okay. Buff Scepter again. I mean, Scepter is still putting in work because it, it, this tray here is really nice. Zealous Scepter. Very good. A lot of might up time. And we'll finish off with this one. Then we'll probably just go get Kainang and then move on. Let's finish this off. We got this uh, hatchery over here. The turtle hatchery. Look at all these eggs. These are all turtles, gamers. Very nice. Oh, see, now we're cooking with gas. Check that out. We're now, we're really going... Just another 15 hero points, and we are in business. Or actually, 14, actually. So we're really looking good. Should be able to unlock this relatively easily by the end of the day. Here's the portal to Kainang. In we go. Blah! Hell yeah. You know, oh, nice hero point as well, actually. Oh, no. I'm going to be too slow. Wait, no, I'm not. Oh, leech! No! Got it. Hell yeah. Easy. I love to see that. That is what we like to see. Mantra of Flame locked in. The Jade Monument. Here we go. Another hero point. Look at that speed. It actually doesn't take that long. Okay. We can probably get a few more in Kaineng. I feel like I'm just saying, we're going to do a few more, then we're going to go somewhere else, guys. We're going to go somewhere else very soon, right? We're going to go somewhere else very, very soon. But honestly, these EOD ones are really easy. I think the EOD and Path of Fire are both really good. So Ender Dragons and Path of Fire are really good for getting hero points, I think. Probably gonna have to do some climbing here, aren't I? Oh. oh. We can make, I, I don't want to drop down at all, right? So I want to stay on these roofs. Because I kind of have a suspicion that this is where we need to be. Okay, good. Right. And we still have to climb, actually. Yeah, see, go, oh, look, go on the roof was the play. Because here it is, actually. Honestly, this is going to be really good for me as well. It means I get to actually experience um, End of Dragons in a way, in the intentional way. 
Uh, because I... Oh, this guy's... I'm gonna help this guy. Wait, what's he... Wait. He's just, like, letting the... He's letting the pets tank? It's big. Whoa. What are those pets doing? This is insane. Okay, good. And that should actually... Oh, the cripple should break it. Yeah, good. The cripple actually did break it. Whoa. Should have used the two. I need to turn on, turn off post processing here. Thank you. Goodbye. Oh, my eyeballs. Kind of forgot to do that at the start of the stream. My eyeballs are gone, but they're back now. Feels good. And we're getting them. We're getting them good. Look, look at this guy. Doesn't even help. Look, friendliest community in MMOs. My ass, dude. Look at that. I'm here in this like epic 1v1 duel against this elite mob. That guy just gets in, gets out. Unbelievable. Yeah. I get to experience the maps as intended, right? I'm getting the full experience. Very cozy. Very cozy experience. All right, great. Another hero point. Down. CC turn. Do I? I guess I can't stand in that, huh? Dude, they all have prot. Where's my boon removal? Playing Guardian. This is tragic. Huh. Whoa. Dude, look. The, the game is teaching me. The game is teaching me to not stand in that. I like it. I'm just going to try and break it with blind. Because also, like, blind... Yeah, blind and cripple, as you can see there. That's also going to um, do defiance bar damage. Huh. And a crane has entered the battle as well. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is it going to burn to death? It is. Boom. Got him. I think the portal to um, Echo World is really nearby, right? So I should definitely just go ahead and take that now. Oh. Stoic demeanor. Boom. Locked in. Oh. Oh. It actually... Will it not... Oh. Will it... Ah. It, is it, it's not going to let me in because I haven't done the story, right? Oh, is that that's Arborstone, actually, isn't it? Yeah, no, that's Arborstone. That's not Echovald, actually. Yeah, that's not the same. Yeah, yeah, that's not right. We have to go somewhere else. Because, yeah, I don't think I... Uh, I always went through the story, right? Because you go Arborstone, then you, it unleashes you into Echovald afterwards, I think. Oh, Echovald is blocked too. Ah, interesting. Very interesting. It demands that you complete the story. The game refuses to let you in. It is gatekeeping. Can I go from Dragon's End backwards? Ooh! That's actually a very good point. Let's see if that actually works. Unlock a mastery. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll get every mastery, every, um, you know, all masteries. I don't care about achievements. Achievements don't really interest me that much, so not achievements, but definitely masteries, yeah. I'll get full masteries. Uh, we'll do everything. We'll do all map completion everywhere. Do every map completion. We'll do the whole thing. Nice. We made it. Can't walk into no, uh, New Kainang from Arborstone. Uh, no, no, I'm already in New Kainang. Um, the reason I came here is because I'm just, I'm just looking for a few, like, extra hero points. Honestly, the ones here are actually really annoying um, because you're going to need, like, um, this is, like, a lot of parkour here. A lot of um, mount stuff is required. So this probably is not really on the menu for me. Uh, not yet, anyway. Not yet on the menu. Oh, I should have actually looked at a hero point train, shouldn't I? To see if there's one going on. It's probably a little bit, probably a little bit late for that now. Um, but yeah. I think what we'll actually go ahead and do, I'm going to go and unlock Path of Fire. Um, here we go. I'm going to go here. We're going to take this teleport to a friend. And we're going to immediately unlock Path of Fire. Just like that. Hell yeah. We're done. We are done. You love to see that. We are in the mix. We can get ourselves some hero points pretty easily here. Uh, should be able to anyway. Okay, I'm actually... Uh, oh yeah, I am going to do that before I leave actually. Let's go ahead and grab the Springer uh, real quick. We have a waypoint there. Let's go get the Springer because there is a way to get it in uh, New Kainang actually. I believe... Where is it, though, actually? I think you have to do a heart. What? Which heart is it, actually? Yeah, it's like the one where you've got to squish the worms, isn't it? Like, you've got to, like, squish the worms. Oh, it, it might be this one, actually. It's either up here. Maybe it's up here, actually. It's, it, yeah, it's, it might be on the north. Here we go. The grubs. It's like, I don't know where it is. Listen, we're going on an adventure. I'm going on my adventure, guys. Here we go. Where are the grubs? Oh, hero point. We can get that pretty easily, I think. I want grubs. And we've been denied the grubs. We've miserably failed to locate them. 
But that's okay. It's going to be worth it when we get there. We're going to get ourselves the spring amount. Look at that burst. This Wait, this mob has swiftness. What was the point in that? Very nice. So I think our grubs are kind of over here. Kind of over... Uh, yeah, let's go over there, I think. This is not right. Ah, it's south here. No, we need to go to the south there for sure. This is not where we want to be. It must be like here, pretty much. We need to teleport over here. Let's see, how do I actually unlock the springer here then? I probably took to talk to the heart person. Hello, heart person. What have you got for me? Ah, there we go. Compromised. Who would do that? Any plan to catch them? Until then, how do I clear the grubs? Squish them. Found that my springer's cannibal is the easiest method. I think I've got it. Boom! They have to do the heart, nice. We already have the springer locked in. Oh yeah. Nice, okay, great. Done. Another hero point. There it is. Boom! Okay, we're basically done here, though. We've got most of the ones here. Yeah, we got- Oh, that's the only one we don't have, actually, yeah. Only one we haven't got. That'll do for now. And we can just finish it off in part of the fire, right? We can probably get- Yeah, we can get a few in Heart of Thorns. We can grab these as well. As well. It should be pretty easy. Okay, here we go. Because there's one that- This is the classic hero point. To jump down there and you can get one immediately. Uh... Oh. We can get the uh, master point too. Value. Oh, we could also be getting the... Um... Man, I, I'm, I'm slacking right now. I should have got the chest. There's a chest there as well. I'm going to go get it for completion. Okay, good. Job done. Another hero point locked in. Mantra of Law. Archivist of Whispers. Oof. Six, six more to go. Uh, is Springer enough to abuse here? I think it is, right? Yeah, Springer can abuse us the way up there, right? Yeah. It's gotta be able to. We're gonna just go the long way around too, I guess. Yeah, is weird. I do feel like I'm playing a different game. Like, without having access to the broken mounts, um, honestly, the game is so much better. Like, the open world is so much more interesting. It's a little sad, actually. Doing this like that. Yeah, it's good. I prefer it a lot. Uh, hero point over there. And we'll finish. We are going to solo the frog. The frog will die to the core guardian, guys. Okay? Core guardian will defeat the frog. Yeah, the, the frog is going to be a challenge. The frog may win today. Uh, because I cannot see it. The stealth attacks will be powerful, but we'll definitely have a go. The frog is here. All right, we just glide, right? Yeah, we can glide to the frog. We get the waypoint first. The frog is gonna get destroyed, guys. We're gonna obliterate the frog. Although we are gonna have to do some weird stuff. Because again, the big problem here is the frog is going to be able to stealth and I can't see it. That is a major issue because it's going to kill me. Um, if that happens. So, I'm not sure how this is going to go, actually. We're going to have to play very defensively um, when this happens, for sure. So, we're going to have to get rid of the adds first. Okay, so the frog is going to die here. Okay. That frog is down. We can block this. And now the big thing is when it shadow steps. Like, that's when we're going to have problems here. Oh, that one isn't fully dead yet, actually. Let's get rid of this one. Okay, so now we're basically in the end game. I mean, we can basically just kite it around forever and it's never going to be able to kill us, right? Because we have ranged. Uh, we can slowly break its bar as well. And just try and kite it around like this. We can keep the break bar pressure up. Okay, it's doing a lot of damage there. There we are. Okay, we've got to play suicide because here's the stealth. Now we've got to get out. We've got to get the fuck out here because it's going to fuck us up. Going to age us here. Okay, good. Okay, we got, I, I'm not sure, uh, maybe I should have played Sanctuary here to be honest. Okay, stealthing up again. I'm just gonna leap away and try and dodge it. Oh, there it is. Okay, good. Okay. Stability is not that useful here. Okay, it's stealthing again. And we just have to rinse and repeat this, right? We've got to rinse and repeat because again, oh yeah, that is what you got to watch out for. That's the problem, right? Litany is juicing us there. See, that is the issue, guys, with the stealth. 
Because I'm not going to be able to predict it doing that. Okay, we Aegis. Because the Aegis is going to come through. Okay. Keep this going here. Yeah, like the Aegis is going to be really big. We could play a little bit more aggressive, but we don't really need to, right? Wait, we have eight minutes to kill this. So time actually is relevant here. It's an epic battle here. Okay, here comes the frog again. Got a projectile block in case it projectiles me. It did. Nice. Huge play by me. Love to see that. Understand the mechanics, my friends. Okay. And we can get a big burst. There it is. Binding Blade will actually... Sh yep, there it is. It's over there. It's over here. Because we saw the Binding Blade. Oh, we had to play very safe here. Because we actually don't have our heal right now. It's going to play very safe. We have a heal in five seconds. The Wasp has activated. Okay. Okay, I can just use the symbol there. I've used the symbol. Great. Use that to reveal it. It's over there. I'm going to hit... Yeah, I did have, didn't have a dodge, unfortunately. Oh, boy. It's stealthing. Good. All right, we have an Aegis, so we're okay. Okay, it's firing a shot. Good. Frog 1v1 is... I should Honestly, I should have played a Firebrand here, I think. I think Firebrand would have been good. Yeah, not the best build, honestly, to do this on. I should have tweaked my build a little bit more. Okay. Go behind it, because the thing is, it, uh, it actually animation locks itself with that attack there. That attack there, we use Aegis here, F3, because we know there's an attack coming. We just actually completely misses anyway. Okay. This is a big 1v1, guys. This is a huge 1v1. Block. There we go. Got it. And again, we just go behind it. Okay. Oh. Go behind it because it animation locks. You have to wait until it starts its animation, though. No! What the fuck? Dude, this guy's in. Look. He can see it. That's cheating. That is cheating right there. There it is. Frog down. Frog is down, dude. Frog is down. Very easy. Frog on free farm, guys. Oh, yeah. Right, and now I actually will swap over to Firebrand because we're basically there, actually. So we're going to go ahead and go Firebrand here because we actually have all of our traits unlocked. So we're going to go over to our Quickness build, basically, and start giving Quickness. And we can take our Mantra of Solace as well. Uh, and just start playing a lot more aggressively with a condition style build. Going with Amplified Wrath, uh, Radiant Fire uh, for more burning duration, and we want Permeating Wrath here. We'll still take Absolute Resolve, actually, for a bit more healing, and we'll take uh, Purging Flames, Stand Your Ground, uh, and I'll take another skill in just a moment. But this is kind of the set that we're going to go with now. Because we can just do a lot of damage with our Tomes as well. Should be very strong.